Hey everybody, it's Jason Blaha here and I just wanted to uh, update everyone who's been trying to keep up with my fat loss, uh, with my changes in my routine, things like that. So let me put on my plus five hat of weaponsmithing, work on skill up my crafting a little bit and let's talk about this. And I'm going to link down below for you guys my Instagram update. Um, I haven't really been doing my weigh-ins on YouTube, how we're doing them on Instagram and Brittany kind of keeps up with that. Uh, but a lot of people are like, man, uh, you know, you haven't lost any weight lately, what's going on? So we thought we would do an actual weigh-in. And yeah, I did drop. I'm down six pounds from the last time I videoed a weigh-in. Uh, I was at 229 before. And keep in mind, guys, I started videoing at, what, 250? Uh, and I was on that exact same scale wearing those exact same boots. So that's 27 pounds lost while maintaining all my strength. Uh, some people are like, hey, you're getting bigger. You know, at first I was kind of thinking... I can't be getting bigger, just got to be getting leaner, but because a few of my little lifts and presses and stuff have gone up slightly, uh, yeah, I might actually be growing a little bit. I'm not blasting gear or anything, none of that's happening, it just happens to be with my training and other stuff going on because of all the carbs I'm eating. Uh, there might have been some mild recomposition in a couple of muscle groups, so yeah, I may have actually gained a little bit of muscle along the way because of the slow nature of the cut uh, and the way I'm training and eating and everything. Uh, it hasn't been very much muscle, but it's been a little bit. But I thought I would show you guys the update uh, because people are like, oh man, you're not losing weight anymore. What happened to your cut? So I, I didn't quit cutting. Just a slow cut. And I'll probably do another video later for you guys uh, kind of discussing why things go the way they do on my cut, how I can predict numbers. Because I knew I was going to swoosh this week. Um, I predicted it a week ago. Remember trading footage last week? I said, guys, the scale's going to be down next time I weigh in. Uh, next week or by the end of this week, uh, the scale's going to go down. And I knew that because I always carb up a little bit heavier the night before. The night before I train, on camera, I usually carb up a little bit. I did that and I didn't gain any weight from it. All right. When I up my calories by about, about 500 calories or so, 500, 600, usually the night before a really heavy session on camera, just so that the performance looks decent, I make sure I get at least one good, really good work in out in every week. Um, the scale didn't go up from it at all. It didn't go up at all. In fact, I was like down a pound from a couple days before. So that tells me I'm about to swoosh and drop some weight. I was honestly expecting to be about 225 today, but it was 223 instead. So I was actually surprised because when I started moving the I'm like, oh, this isn't right. Like I had actually gone back and re-zeroed it before we turned the camera on to make sure because I'm like, this can't be right. I can't be uh, in this range because it was showing me in the, like 222 at first. I'm like, no, 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 let me double check this scale. And it ended up being 223. Uh, so that's what we're going to call it with the same boots on that I've been doing the weigh-in in on the exact same scale. Uh, so that's where it is. And it's there on Instagram for you guys to see. And I want to remind people, like I keep having to tell you, a lot of people get in involved conversations with me on Instagram. I, I don't actually post on my Instagram more than about once a week. Uh, Brittany runs it for me because she loves Instagram. She likes Instagram. Uh, she likes that aspect of social media. So just an FYI, when you guys get in those big arguments and political debates, it's, it's not actually me. It's not an official statement from me. I've made it public knowledge uh, that Brittany actually runs my Instagram because she loves Instagram. Uh, she wanted to start it for me, and so she keeps it up to date. And I check in every now and then to read what people are saying, occasionally pull a video thing. Occasionally, I will answer one of your questions there, but it's not the best way to... Uh, reach me. You can do that on my Facebook fan page. Uh, I start the Q&A thread there every day or just the video comments themselves. I'm more likely uh, than anything to do that. But I do like to take video topics sometimes from the Instagram. But if it's if it's an actual engaging conversation and I'm answering you there, uh, that's, that's probably not me. That's usually Brittany. I mean, she'll argue with you about politics if you really want, but don't think that you're, you're getting my opinion on anything. Because we laughed about that because we had someone kind of getting a big argument with her the other day and, and he thought he was arguing with me and he really wasn't but it, I thought it was public knowledge because I tell everybody I don't actually do that there um, so we just let him do it and she had fun with it because if he really followed my channel he knew that she runs that for me uh, but that's okay so there you have it guys uh, I'll probably discuss a little further later uh, so go check it out if you want to keep up with where my weigh-ins are so that's uh, 27 pounds lost since this cut started I'm keeping all my muscle keeping all of my strength and uh, we'll see what happens when I get to 200. 27 down, 23 to go to get to 200, and then we'll assess from there, won't we? We'll see where we're at. So I hope it's been informative, and I will talk to you guys next time.